Hi everyone, it's Tammy, and I thought that we would do a walkthrough of my planner for 2018. Now that it is almost 2019, crazy. So, ooh, I just want to show you like each layout for every week, and I will try to be a little bit fast, but not too fast. So here's my monthly, and I don't use my monthlies very much in this year, so I am going to switch that up for next year, but... Here is, um, that one's really cute. This is my January New Year's. And I don't think I have a New Year's kit to use this year. Maybe I do. I just haven't looked. I need to do that. Super cute. And, oh, this one's cute too. This Poppy Willow Company, man. She is amazing. I love this blue color. It's so pretty. It's so cute to look at some of the things that I did and all of that. Oh my gosh, I love this one too. <laughs> Am I going to do this every week? I don't know, maybe. Oh, that was my surgery. I'm almost a year out. And then here is this beautiful blue and gold one. And then January 29th, I may have done over in February. I don't think I skipped it. There's my weekly, or my monthly. Yeah, January 29th through February 4th was Super Bowl, so I did that. Very cute. Especially since I'm not even a sports fan, so that's cool. And here is the next week of February, and it has these little owls that were all cold and scarved up. Super cute. And here's a Valentine's week. Another really cute one. And looks like I had a little idea to do a planner thing in here with meal ideas and some goals and some to-dos. Wow, I didn't stick with that, I don't think. But um, this is the Flintstones, and oh my gosh, I'm loving it. So cute. And then... We have the March monthly, and here is February 26th through March 4th. It's Alice in Wonderland. We're all mad here. So cute. And here is the 5th through the 11th. This was my birthday week, so I wanted it to be pinky and girly and all pretty. And here are some cute foxes. And, oh, I skipped this week. Kitty was home though. So that's the first week that I've skipped. And I've skipped more this year. I've, I don't know that I've ever skipped a week until now. So it's crazy, but um, this one's really cute. This must have been Easter week. Yes, Easter Sunday, adorable. I love that. And then here is April, the monthly. Oh, the cute bunny. And here's April 2nd through 8th. I love that too. Oh, and Strawberry Shortcake is the 9th through the 15th. And then here is the 16th through the 22nd of April. Poppy Willow does it again with their beautiful foiling. And then here's the cute one with hot cocoa. I like these colors too, and I like how it's muted. And this washi is really cute. And then we get into May. And I have um, Beatrice Potter. Beatrix Potter. Ooh, and look at these beautiful unicorn. The purple and lavender and all the different colors. So cute. And then the Jetsons. That's fun. Oh, I got some coach bags. I need to open my window. I'm warm. I've been in here for a little minute and the lights are getting to me. And I'm going to take a drink of my coffee, but first coffee. 
and it's the countdown to Alex's graduation. Oh, I loved this one too. This was a one from Victoria Thatcher. I just love all these cute little animals. It's very cute. And here's graduation week. Yay for Alex. His graduation was on Saturday, June 2nd. And here is June 4th through 10th. I love the animals, of course. I love me some critters. And this one's cute. Um, June 11th through 17th. It's like old time secretary. I don't know what else to call that, but it's cute. And then June 18th through 24th, I did um, Kate Spade. Yeah, that's sad. And this one's all about knitting, June 25th through July 1st. Oh, I love it. And then here is July, the monthly for that. And 4th of July week, I did red, white, and blue. And then July 9th through 15th, I did with these cute cats. This is Victoria Thatcher. I think this is a lot of Victoria Thatcher coming up. Yeah, here's her with um, with God, all things are possible. I love that. Gosh, I love all of these. It's fun to go back and look through this. I hope that you guys are enjoying it too. July 23rd through 29th, Book Lover. And then we get into August. The heart of the summer here and I did a summery theme with um, what's that say summer I don't know what it says sparkle and shine don't be afraid to sparkle a little brighter Saturday sparkle I wish I could read that summer frills maybe I don't know but it's cute nonetheless and oh my, this one's adorable too. I like how I did the washi and the purple. And that's really cute. Sometimes I like ideas that I've done in the past. When I see them, I'm like, oh gosh, I really like that. And something that caught my eye here was that I used the same sticker. I used the Pusheen cat sticker for all of my little things. And I like that. But I don't always like to use the same theme. But sometimes that's kind of fun. And here are some more critters that I just love. And I even like how I used cardstock and just did a plain blank square with cardstock on a lot of these. I like that. And then here we go into August 20th through 26th. And this says, make today ridiculously amazing and has these wonderful kiddos and critters. So neat. Lots of things happened in 2018. And then September. That's a cute monthly. And here is September 3rd through 9th. And I love this one too. Boss Babe. That's awesome. And Corella de Villa is September 10th through 16th. Darling, looking good is better than being good. <laughs> cool. And here's Coffee and Pumpkins. Oh, does it get any better than that? The 17th through the 23rd. Take Embroidery Machine in for service. I think I must have had that in there 16,000 times and I still haven't done it. I just know it's going to be expensive and I just haven't wanted to spend the money on it yet. Oh my gosh, this is one of my favorite kits ever of all time. This little hedgehog is too cute. September 24th through, 20, through 30th, the 26th is my dad's birthday and this, I'm just going to hold this up really close so you guys can see this wonderful hedgehog. Oh, this is Poppy Willow and 
I'm not kidding. I love this owl too, and the deer. I love all of them, but this has to be, honest to God, one of my favorite kits of all time, ever. If not my favorite. And then here is October, and the monthly for that is awesome. And, woo, this is cool. This is October 1st through 7th. And I don't remember what she called this one, but it's like a Cinderella, a Halloween Cinderella. I love it. And then I didn't do this week or this week. Crazy bad. Um, but then we got back into it with a bang using um, cute Fall is Here sticker kit. I'm loving it. And then a Halloween sticker kit. How cute is that? And this is Halloween week. Look at that. That is just adorable. And my November, I love that too. My November monthly. And then here is November 5th through 11th with more critters because they are my favorites. And November 12th through 18th with a very fall theme. Very cute. And then November 19th through 25th, that is... Um, uh, Thanksgiving week and this is the week that I went to Chicago and I didn't do this week unfortunately and I love these I do need to do one of these for every month because they are cute so here's my December monthly and then December 3rd through 9th is like Starbucks super cute and then December 10th through 16th is kind of a uh, little, ha little House on the Prairie, no, um, Little Red Riding Hood. And then December 17th through 23rd is a Holly Jolly layout. And then Christmas week is Bethlehem. So that is everything for this, and I am going to do December 31st through the 6th in 2019. So stay tuned for that. I have it here. I haven't even punched the holes in it yet, so I have my work cut out for me. I need to get that done. Maybe I'll do it now. I don't know. But um, yeah, comment below. Let me know what your favorite layout was or what your favorite layout is or who your favorite sticker place is. But this was really fun. I like going back and looking. And I do save my planners. I save them year after year. I don't save the whole binder and everything. I take the insides out and I put them in a box with the label of the year. And that way I can go back and look if I need to. But thank you for watching. And I really appreciate all of you. And I hope that you all had a wonderful 2018. And I hope that we all have a better 2019. Bye-bye.